What do you think about before you fall asleep? I tell myself a story. Making myself a character in said story. Then I adventure until sleep takes me. It's rather entertaining as long as I am calm enough to go through the story slowly. The random cringe moments in my life from when I was a kid and hoping those people don't remember. Even though I haven't seen him in over 10 years. I worry and overthink about the future. Try not to have a panic attack make up a story pretend someone is cuddling me. How long is Godzilla's dong? I think about what life would be like if things were better. At first I go through a mental checklist of stuff I needed to do before getting in bed. Then I fantasize about sleeping. Genuine sleeping. Not adult wrestling. With a random dude. Sometimes faceless. Sometimes not. Most of the time the thoughts revolve around whatever sleep sound noise plays off my Alexa to fall asleep. Recently it's been a guy the first liked, but never talked to, my future significant other. A recap of the day. Dragons. What I'm doing tomorrow. Avoiding the spot that I just came on and how much these sheets used to be worth. Will I get up tomorrow morning or is this the end? I pretend I'm in a first person shooter. It's my way of counting sheep I guess. Sometimes I'm a fabulously wealthy individual. Or massively kinky sex orgies. Or simple old man generosity. Or other unmentionable stuff. It varies. Making up scenarios. Why did I do that stupid thing in fifth grade? How I should stop scrolling on my phone so I can actually start to fall asleep. That time in fifth grade where I thought this guy the first had a crush on waved to me so I enthusiastically waved back and talked dot his ear off. He was waving at his friend behind me. The look of horror on his face is forever etched in my brain. My flaws and if I'm falling behind in life. My plans for tomorrow. Some variation of how much I hate my life. How long it's gonna take me to fall asleep. How lonely I am LMAO. About going to sleep. About the book I just read for an hour. Or about what I plan to do the next day. Too much lol. First contact scenarios. I guess I read too much sci-fi. Happy memories usually. I think about falling asleep. I'm trying to write a book. Build a world. And that's usually when I try new ideas on for size. I imagine character interactions and how that might affect things. Or I'll think about geography and how a series of mountains isolating a village or township from the rest of the country might affect the people there. What is the local flora like? And how will that affect different visuals? Or more importantly, how does the local vegetation affect the soldiers during the civil war that is currently ongoing? That scrubby, sandy area makes digging trenches easier. But then sand gets everywhere and the dude's morale goes down. How do commanders combat this? It's also fun to imagine characters at rest. Which is pure world building that will never matter. How did that one guy feel about a trip to Latin America? Or does he fantasize about learning to play the drums? How do these people become people and not just vehicles for a story? Would one character ever be friends with another had circumstances not forced them together? If so what would they be like? What would they do together? I have friends I game with. And other friends I play sports with. And those two groups don't really combine for obvious reasons. How the hell am I gonna fall asleep? Anything silly or unreal. If I let myself drift away from stressful realities or memories. I sleep better. The more I focus on important things. The more awake I get. My thoughts are usually not too kind so I try to drown them out with entertainment. 
so I fall asleep scrolling or watching something basically every night. How we are all on a floating rock in the middle of nowhere and will probably explode any second. A hope that I don't wake up. Sex honestly. Various. Most nights it's about my love life, and some I think about the weird things in life. Fantasies of how I would like to live in the near future. Including lifestyle, relationships, and career. My family, work, my sports teams, what movie I want to watch, etc. Are oranges spelt oranges? Because oranges are orange or is orange spelt orange because oranges are orange. My favorite sleep position is laying on my back, but sometimes I sleep on my side with my arms. Folding around while imagining someone is hugging me. I pat my back and run my fingers through my hair imagining my mom or my sister doing it. Occasionally I'll panic, fear death and not waking. IDK pretty stupid but therapy helps. Your mother's sweet blowjobs. Sex. Not even lying. I just make fantasies and shit. For whatever reason I have really vivid imagination and anything I've ever felt I can replay the feeling in my mind. So I just start with that and drift off. Honestly. Most of the time I think about my boyfriend before I fall asleep. Especially since most of the time we talk before I fall asleep. Whether I fall asleep on accident or not.